existence of derivatives if y equals f of x and x equals a then f prime at a or the derivative of the function f at x equals a is the limit as h approaches zero of the different quotient f of a plus h minus f at a or divided by h You see the a there, a there, and a there. If the limit fails to exist, then f of x is not differentiable at x equals a. Next, we are going to look at conditions of a non-differentiable function. A function f of x is not differentiable at x equals a if any of the following is true. Number one, function f of x is discontinuous at x equals a. Number two, the graph of f of x has a sharp corner at x equals a. Number three, the tangent line at x equals a is a vertical line, or the slope is undefined. As three figures. For the first figure, the function is f of x equals one over x. The function is not defined at x equals zero. That means at x equals zero, the function is not continuous or is discontinuous at x equals zero. So then f of x is not differentiable at x equals zero. The second graph, f of x equals x minus three quantity times x to the power two thirds. It has a sharp corner at x equals a or at x equals zero. Therefore, the function is not differentiable at x equals zero. And the last graph, the graph of f of x equals the cube root of x, it looks like it's a smooth graph. This is a continuous and no sharp corner. But at the point zero, the slope is undefined. So in this case, at x equals zero is not differentiable as well. We also can say that the function f of x is continuous at x equals a if and only if the left-handed limit of the function equals the function value at a equals the right-handed limit of the function as it approaches a. Recall the two-sided limit. Limit f of x as x approaches a, no superscript as plus or minus i. This is a two-sided limit. It does exist if and only if the left-hand side equals the right-hand side limit. Therefore, the function at a equals the two-sided limit as x approaches a means the function is continuous at x equals a. For the graphical way, in the xy plane at the point x equals a, the graph is smooth and the direction from the left and from the right side coming toward to the same value as the function at A.